Hi, I was installing Windows and it kept on giving me this error that Windows cannot be installed on this drive. I found out how you can be able to maneuver and install Windows. In this video, I'll be sharing you how I was able to install Windows from start to end. So without further ado, let's get started. So you can see here is the error. You cannot be able to install Windows on Drive 0, Partition 2. And so I'll be sharing with you the steps. So all I want you to do is to click OK and then uh -huh. I want you to come on your keyboard and I want you to press Shift F10. So you Shift F10, that will open the CMD. And I want you to type in Disk Part. Just like that, press Enter. And then Disk Part will be loaded. And here I want you to type a uh, list, sorry, list disk. And here it will list the disks that we have installed on the computer. And we can see we have disk 0 and disk 1. And so I want you to select disk 0 because that is where we are going to be installing our windows. So type in select disk 0. You might have more disks than I am. So you have to select the one that you want to install in. And now here it has been selected. Next I want you to type clean. And after that I want you to press enter. Disk part succeeded in cleaning the disk. That's okay. So once it's successful, now I want you to just exit this very CMD just like that. And uh, I want you to come and click on close. So we want to refresh this. Okay, so we close here, click yes, and we'll now restart the installation. So we'll click on install. And uh, here I'll click on I don't have product key. And you'll select the windows you want to install and click next. And just give it a moment. And here we'll agree and then click next. Then we'll custom install. And here I want you to click on next. Now the installation process has started and it's going to take several minutes. So I'm going to be cutting this video so that we don't waste a lot of time. It will restart several times. So you need to be patient and uh, just give it a moment here. Uh, we just need to press F1 to load the boot menu uh, just like that. And uh, the Windows 10 will start uh, loading starting services just like that and you'll give it a moment to load and uh, in no time it will be loading now we are at a hundred percent getting started and uh, here when you see this blue screen you know you're on the right track we don't have internet so we'll click there and here we'll just click continue with limited setup and uh, give it a moment who's going to use this pc so you will name your pc just like that and so i want you to click on next and here create a super memorable password so we're going to create our password click next repeat the password again and click next we will answer three security questions and we are going to do that pretty quick and uh, after you are done you'll just click next just a moment uh -huh, we are almost through let cortana help you get things done we'll just accept just like that and just a moment and it will restart again hi and uh, okay we are getting everything ready for you this might take several minutes so you'll give it a moment don't turn off your pc at this moment and voila, we've been able to install Windows and here it is and it's functioning. So this is how you need to uh, go around and be able to install Windows when you're given this error. And you can see it is functioning uh, very well and everything is as it should be. And uh, it will be as easy as that. So I hope that this video helped you. And if that is the case, Please like this video and, and if you like my general content, feel very free to subscribe 
with notifications on so that you can be the first person to be notified whenever we upload a video on this channel. Otherwise, I want you to click anywhere on the screen to watch our next video and I'm pretty sure that I'll see you in that